GoTuity is just really all about connecting to the location. Um, so, for example, people are able to start conversations where they stand, and the people around them are able to interact in those conversations in real time. And so our whole goal, like for example in the conference environment, is to um, allow people to be able to connect to the location kind of and see the conversations that are happening here, find the one that's most relevant to them, and then connect to it. And because they have a shared location, to be able to say, hey, you know what, by the way, I'm over by the water fountain, once you come visit me. So speeding up the face-to-face -face interaction. When people say it's, a, it's an app, we actually build it as a platform. And that's important because um, we, we want to allow other people to leverage our resources. So, so what we're doing is building out location infrastructure. Right. So similar to like a Facebook or Twitter where people connect into them and that's what we want people to do. Right. But when people come into us, they just go in through their browser or their mobile phone or their desktop computer, any device that has an internet connection, and they literally um, just type in GoTwitty.com and they're able to see the conversation that are happening there, but the really cool part is they're able to filter it. So anywhere from 0.5 miles all the way out to 15 miles. I think it's a little bit of all of them. I think it's a system professional tool um, because there's definitely applications. For example, a vendor starting a group here and allowing potential customers to come in and, and, and view uh, and see what they're talking about. So that's a business tool. But then also there's components of it which are social. For example, we're, we're going to release a favor feature where you favor your friend and as your friend goes about the nation dropping notes across in different towns and cities, if you happen to be in that location, you pop open go to the, you see a message that's from your friend that says, hey, by the way, since you're here, why don't you check out you know, oh, this cool. bar or this restaurant or something like that. But, but it's been absolutely amazing. I mean, you spend a lot of time and, and, and just energy just trying to build these products out and you try to think about them and then you try to take it out there and get feedback from people. And then when you get to these kind of conferences, it's kind of like putting your baby out there and hoping people accept it. Yeah. And so the reception's been really, really warm. People say, hey, what you're doing really makes sense. It has value. Um, and that has really a lot to do because from day one, we didn't want to develop the product in like a stealth environment. We wanted to make sure that we got feedback and we talked to people that we didn't know and we really incorporated that feedback into our product which obviously shows today because you know people say okay this makes sense. Initially the convention arena is it's like one of our initial target markets because the instant group is right for that. You know, the vendor being able to start a group and talk to the people in the location for the people in the location to interact with them. So that's our first area. Although the product does have a lot of consumer benefits, um, um, the convention arena is it, and then other features as we roll it out. So it'll be like a hybrid of both a business product and a consumer product, just like a Twitter would be or Facebook.